<clears throat> Once again, I'm seeing all your pretty faces. I'm very happy for that, guys. Thank you for supporting this channel. Yeah. How's it going, guys? It's your boy Skeda. Welcome to my crib. For those of you who don't know me, I'm Skeda. I produce electronic music. I make free sample packs, and of course, I make YouTube videos. If you want to learn new things, expand your creativity, or just entertain yourself, then make sure to smash that subscribe button and hit the bell so you don't miss anything, yeah. And real quick before we start, let me know if you have any ideas for a future video or any production tip that you would like to share with everyone. So guys, in today's video I'm gonna show you how to make a melodic sound you can use in your drops if you make melodic rhythm, future rhythm, or anything dubstep similar melodic okay so and also guys i made a second sound and i'm gonna have both of them in my patreon page if you want to download them directly so without of talking guys let's dive into the project so guys this is the project right here <laughs> This is the sound that I'm gonna show you. And also, I'm gonna have both of them in my Patreon page. So, let's start. Open Vital. Oscillator 1, Oscillator 2. On Oscillator 1, we're gonna use the Initiate Wavetable. We don't have to do anything. On Oscillator 2, we're gonna use basic shapes, factory basic shapes, okay? So, Oscillator 1, level 0.500. Oscillator 2, level 0. Oscillator 1, transpose 12. And Oscillator 2, transpose 24. Oscillator 1, spectrum morph is gonna be 59.43%. And we're gonna use Sherpan tone, okay. And the wave morph, the wave morph on the second, on the first oscillator is gonna be at zero, and we're gonna choose FM oscillator two because because we're gonna do frequency modulation. Um, on second oscillator, we're gonna choose right now at the spe on the spectral morph, we're gonna choose uh, harm harmonic stretch. And we're gonna bring it at 71, 72, something like that, doesn't matter. Um, wave morph at zero, and, and yeah, at zero. And we're gonna choose pulse. Okay, this is it. Uh, also, guys, on first wave table, frame at zero. On the second wave table, frame at 100, almost 150. After that, guys, we go to the LFO. Give it a shape, something like that. All you have to do is basically bring it here and lower this one and you have the same shape, okay? Frequency at one eighth, I guess, okay? And mode trigger. Once you do that, I'll grab LFO1 and bring it at oscillator, uh, at oscillator 1 at the waveform, okay? Here it is. And almost all the way up, almost. Something like that is just perfect. After that, guys, we go to the effects. We're gonna use distortion, drive all the way up and nothing else. After that, we go to chorus, voices 16, frequency, all the way down, bring it, freeze. Feedback, almost 40%, mix 50%, cutoff 60, delay 2, 1.8, delay 1, 1.9. After that, a little bit of compressor, mix all the way up, attack all the way up, release all the way down. And phaser, bring it all the way down, freeze, feedback 41%, center 175, depth 
24 semitones mix all the way up, okay? And after that, guys, just a little bit of reverb, almost 8, 9%, time 0.39, and size 36%. And guys, this is it for this sound. It was actually very easy to make it. But I truly believe it's very effective and pretty awesome if you want to use it in your rhythm, dub some tracks in general, you know better, okay? Guys, thank you for watching. Don't forget you can download this sound and the other sound on my Patreon page. Don't forget to subscribe on my YouTube channel. Don't forget to like this video if you enjoyed it and share it with your friends, yeah? Thank you for watching, see you next time.